where I will sweat literally my pits off. Um, yeah, so I'm kind of like a hot mess, literally. But maybe I need like a second opinion. What do you think? Do I smell? Excuse me while I take a sip of my iced espresso. Oh man. Hey guys, welcome back. I don't know how many of you guys watched my stink bug natural deodorant review, which is right here. Anyways, when I posted that video, I actually got contacted by stink, stink bug naturals themselves asking if I would like to be sent any more products and to test them out for you guys. And I said, sure, why not? Since I really did love this paste. Not, this, is, this video actually is not sponsored. They just sent me free products and I'm going to tell you how I feel about them. Um, not being paid at all by any means. I had been using this paste actually ever since that video. And then they did send me a couple of new goodies when I was in San Diego. And so I will put that unboxing video here. week and a half I have been using this stick and the stick looks like this normal to me it honestly they all smell the same I, I got the stick in atomic in tangerine spice which is the same as the paste and in pinecone. I actually got pinecone for Emilio and I really want him, wanted him to put this to the test but he's out traveling for work so he hasn't tried this yet. Uh, and I got the stink bug naturals, the uh, chapstick which I'm actually, I have on my lips right now and I'm gonna put a little bit more on. It's nice, the chapstick's really nice. It's like normal chapstick. I just like, I guess that it is organic and they actually also sent me um, a hand sanitizer and I, I've been using it and I actually took it with me uh, to Spain and unfortunately I left it in the hotel room so I'm sorry stink bug but I was using the the hand sanitizer and it was not, it was a really thick consistency like a thick formula um, I, I, I can't really tell like if it killed germs or not it was okay so I actually have been using the stick uh, the last week and a half while I've been in Spain and I really like it. I think it's easier to travel with. It's like more portable. This, I mean it's small, but it's just, I don't know, it's an awkward shape to like throw in your bag. If that makes any sense, this for me, I just, it lays flat so it's easier to pack. And I like this. Um, um. The, uh, the difference is that this is actually 100% vegan because there's no beeswax and this has beeswax. So I really can't tell the difference. I mean, to me, um, I, I used the stick the whole time I was in Spain and I did not smell, which is amazing. But today I actually want to put the test. I want to do one armpit Paste one armpit stick and see like if there is an actual difference. So, let's do it. I have freshly waxed pits. And I figured what better way, what better time to do it now while I'm go about to go outside and run some errands in the desert um, where I will sweat literally my pits off. All right, so left pit. We're gonna do, we're gonna use a tangerine spice stick, okay? One, two. I do like four swipes just because I don't know if that's too many, but that's what I do, okay? So much easy, it's very easy, messy free application. Next, the cream, okay? Get your fingers in there, all right. Is that too much, too little? I don't know. Get it all on that pit. All right, so 
let's see. I'm gonna be gone and I'm gonna be using public transportation. So I know I'm gonna sweat. And I will check back in. We're gonna put that to the test and see. But they look the same. They're both clear on. So I will check back in with you guys later. Four hours later, after those few hours, my lips are still like, like there's still product on it. Still feels like, like coconut oil or um, still feels very, very soft. Whereas other normal chapsticks, like I always I feel like I'm reapplying every freaking five minutes. So I like this stuff. So let's let's check out how the pits work. Left pit was the stick. Right pit was the paste. Let's see. I have not like reapplied. I just got back. I'm like. You know what, it's not sweat, it's like stickiness, kind of oily from the deodorant. The deodorant has coconut oil in it. You are gonna have that oily sensation. I don't really mind it. All right. No smell for the pit, for the cream. like the smallest amount of smell on this one. And maybe I'm just oversensitive. Maybe I need like a second opinion. What do you think? Do I smell? <laughs> um, but I do notice actually a difference. I do notice that this is a little more stinky than this. This, there's nothing. I mean, it smells like absolutely nothing. And this, I don't know. I don't know what I smell. I don't smell BO, but like, a little bit of something where I'm actually going to reapply this right now. But you know what? I would say like it's, if you carry this with you and just like reapply it in the bathroom, it's totally fine. Whereas this, I don't need to reapply. Um, I highly recommend it. I'm a fan. I'm gonna be using both of these like simultaneously. Uh, I want to thank Stink Bugs for sending me these sticks. I really absolutely love the the product and I love that they're all natural and that they don't and that they don't contain harsh chemicals because you know you YOLO and you don't want to be put in like aluminum and stuff in those pores I finally realized that that's, that's not okay I highly recommend it if you are wanting to think about trying and testing out all natural deodorant uh, I, like I said, mentioned in the last video, I have tried several various ones, and this is the first one that I have not smelled. Um, so try it out. Use my code, Sophie's World. Let me know. I'm not 100% sure if they ship internationally. They didn't want to ship to my Italian address, which is why I had them ship to uh, the address where I was going to be at in the US. I'll double check if they international ship or not, because for all my international viewers, that would suck. Um, I know you can also get it at some retailers, Whole Foods being one of them. I don't think all Whole Foods carries them though. But anyways, if you guys have tried Stink Bug, what do you think? Let me know. Uh, and yeah, until next time, ciao.